Ang numero, kapag ka meron siyang mga factors na higit sa isang pares, composite siya. Pag wala siyang uh, factor, kundi sarili niya at saka 1, siya ay prime number. Magandang buhay! Today, we will discover the factors of a given numbers. What are the so-called prime numbers, composite numbers, and multiples of a given number. Pero bago yan, magpahiyang muna tayo. Ang kwento ko ngayon sa inyo ay tukul ulit sa kwento ng mag -ina. Mula sa kwento o hango sa kwento ni Isabelita Ako. Ah, eto na siya. Meron mag -ina. Yung anak, lumapit sa ina. Parang may problema, yung bata. Sabi niya sa nanay niya, Nanay, hihingi po sana ako ng 500 eh. Sabi nung ina, Ano? 400? Ang laki naman ng 300 na hinihingi mo? Ano naman ang gagawin mo sa 200? Ang... Kala ba, madali lang makahanap ng 100? 50 nga ang hirap kitain, 20 pa kaya? Swerte ka, may 10 pa ako dito. O, heto, 5 piso. Sumagot ang bata, Tindi mo, nai? Akin na nga yan, baka maging piso pa. Hmm, natawa na lang ang nanay. O ngayon, punta na tayo sa lesson natin. Prime numbers. From the definition, Prime numbers are numbers greater than one which has no other factor beside itself Let and us have one. An example of prime numbers. Example number one is two. Uh, to find out whether this is a prime number, let us get the factors of 2. What are the factors of 2? Yung tinatawag nating factors, ano ba ang mga numero na pag pinag-multiply natin, ang magiging sagot ay 2. O di 1 and 2. 1 times 2 is equal to 2. O meron pa bang factors ang 2 maliban sa 2? At sa 1, wala na. O another example is 3. What are the factors of 3? Numero na kapag pinag-multiply nyo, 3 ang sagot. Yun ang factors. O edi, 1 times 3. Meron pa ba? Wala na. So, the factors of 3 are 1 and itself, which is 3. Another example is 5. What are the factors of 5? The factors of 5 are 1 and 5 or 1 times 5. Meron pa ba na factors ang 5 maliban sa sarili niya at sa 1? Wala na. O another example is 7. 7. What are the factors of 7? The factors of 7 are 1 and 7 or 1 times 7. Maliban sa 1 at sa sarili niya, Meron pa ba siyang ibang factors? Wala na rin. So, nasatisfy natin ang definition ng prime numbers na prime numbers are numbers which has no other factor beside itself and 1. Or how about bigger numbers such as 73 and 97? Kung wala ng factor ang 73, kundi 1 at sarili niya, Ang 73 ay prime number. How about 97? Kung yung 97 ay wala ng ibang factor kundi 1 at saka sarili niya na 97, this number is also a prime number. Okay, let us again define prime numbers. Prime numbers are numbers greater than 1 which has no other factor beside itself and 1. O ngayon, punta tayo sa composite numbers. Ang composite numbers ay kabaligtaran ng prime numbers. Ang composite numbers naman ay numbers having other factors besides itself and one. O let us try. Here are examples. Yung four. What are the factors of four? O one and four or one times four. Maliban sa 1 and 4, meron pa ba siyang ibang factor? Meron pa. 2 times 2. O so, dalawang pares na ng factors, mayroon ang 4. O how about 6? Let us try 6. 
1 times 6 is 6. O, up, except 1 and 6. Meron pa kaya? Let us try 2 and 3. 2 times 3 is also equal to 6. 4 and 6 now are composite numbers. Why? Because they have other factors beside itself and 1. O, how about 8? What are the factors of 8? The factors of 8 are 1 and 8 and 2 and 4. Or 2 times 4, 1 times 8 is equal to 8. Another example is 9. The factors of 9 are 1 and 9. Maliban sa 1 and 9, meron pa. That is 3 and 3. Ayan, makita niyo yung pagkakaiba ng dalawa. Prime numbers are numbers na walang ibang factor maliban sa sarili niya at saka sa 1. Ang composite numbers naman ay meron siyang mga factors maliban sa sarili niya at saka sa 1. Yan ang mga composite numbers. O magbigay nga tayo ng example ng composite number na Uh, greater than 9 but less than 100. Oh, how about 99? Uh, 99, is it a prime number or a composite number? 99 is a composite number because it has other factors beside itself and 1. Oh, ano pa? 11 times 9 is 99. Oh, di ba? Or how about 33 times 3? Or 33 times 3 is also 99. So ang 99, maraming factors maliban sa sarili niya at saka sa 1. That is why 99 is a composite numbers. Para ma-determine nyo kung composite o prime numbers siya, tingnan nyo. Ang numero, kapag ka meron siyang mga factors na higit sa isang pares, composite siya. Pag wala siyang uh, factor, kundi sarili niya at saka one, siya ay prime number. O ngayon, ano naman yung tinatawag na multiples? Ang tinatawag na multiples ay, eto example. Example, multiples of two. What are the multiples of two? Uh, the multiples of two are two, 4, 6, 8, 10, and so on and so forth. Uh, how about 3? What are the multiples of 3? The multiples of 3 are 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, and so on and so forth. Uh, ngayon, multiples of 4. Multiples of 4 are 4, 8, 12, 16, and so on, and so forth. Uh, how about 5? What are the multiples of 5? The multiples of 5 are 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, and so on, and so forth. Uh, how about 10? What are the multiples of 10? The multiples of 10 are 10, 20, 30, 40, and so on, and so forth. How about 100? What are the multiples of 100? 100, 200, 300, and so on, and so forth. Ayan ang tinatawag nating multiples. In short, tingnan natin, balikan natin yung 2. Yung 2, i-times natin sa 1. 2 times 1 is 2. 2 times 2 is 4. 2 times 3 is 6, 2 times 4 is 8, 2 times 5 is 10. O same is true with 3, 4, 5, 10, and 100. 3 times 1 is 3, 3 times 2 is 6, 3 times 3 is 9, 3 times 4 is 12, 3 times 5 is 15, 3 times 6 is 18. O 4, 4 times 1 is 4, 4 times 2 is 8, 4 times 3 is 12, 4 times 3 is 10. 4 is 16, and so on, and so forth. 5. 5 times 1 is 5. 5 times 2 is 10. 5 times 3 is 
5 times 4 is 20, etc. 10. 10 times 1 is 10. 10 times 2 is 20. 10 times 3 is 30. 10 times 4 is 40. And so on and so forth. 100 times 1 is 100. 100 times 2 is 200. 100 times 3 is 300, etc. O yan ang tinatawag nating mga multiples. Alright. Now, I hope that the factors of a given number, prime numbers, composite numbers, and multiples are clear. O hanggang sa susunod po, magkita-kita tayo muli. But, don't forget to subscribe to my channel below this video. Like, comment, and share. Marami pong salamat. Bye-bye!